Hi guys, it's Triple C. Here's a quick demonstration of Raspberry Pi, XBMC, and yes, a remote control app from the Play Store. So the idea is to use the uh, network, use Wi-Fi, your home network to control your XBMC. So. First thing you want to do is to go to uh, systems, settings, and to services, and then turn all those services on. You go, you go to uh, UPnP, turn it on. You go to web server, turn it on. And the port, I just leave it 80, it was already preset. And then I added a username, but no password. Allow program to control, go yes on everything, and zero com, turn it on, and you should be good to go. Now, once you have that information ready, you go back to system, but system info. It should give you your IP address of your Raspberry Pi, which that's the information you need to connect the app to the XBMC. Okay, so. Once you go in, you click on start. Ah, what happened? Okay, once you go in, you press on start. You'll try to scan your system to see if there's any system that's already there. It'll be detecting host. And you'll probably be no host detected. That's fine, just go on next. And then you can add host yourself since now we know the IP address of that machine, then we can just key it in. One nine two. Dot one six a. Dot two. Dot twenty three. Okay. And the port is default at uh, eighty, so we put eighty. And add host. And it finds it. That's it. Okay, so finish. Now we have the XBMC connected to the Yes app. And now you can control with your cell phone over the network. Very convenient, eh? There's some other functions like if you press that, you bring it right to the video library. You press that, it'll bring it right to the music library. Some other functions, the picture for sure. Some other functions, I'm not too sure what they are. And uh, here, you can swipe it instead of instead of the D-pad. We can go back to D-pad if you prefer that. That you can bring you back to home and volume control and some other stuff that I haven't tried yet, but now you can figure it out. You also you can also bring out the keyboard if you need to type and you can enable a PVR function which uh, to record from your XBMC. I think that's what it is anyway. I haven't tried it. Don't really have interest on that. Anyway, yeah, so very good. A remote control for your XBMC. So another thing you can do with that is to string video as well. Say if I open a YouTube app on my phone. And now I open a video. You can string this video right onto the uh, Raspberry Pi XBMC what's that option there the share button send to XBMC and it will come out like that and you will stream the YouTube video you're watching right onto your XBMC much like the Google 
uh, Chromecast, which is very cool. But does it work with other apps? I don't know. But it's just nice to know that it has this function to do this. Okay, so uh, that'll be all for now. Just a quick demonstration on that app, which I find very interesting. And thank you for watching. See you next time.